Uh, all right, Nick. Let's see how Dracula does now. Blah, blah, blah. I, I'll admit, I kind of wish we had one of our friends here to do his, uh, you know, his Transylvanian accent the entire time. Um, yes, I forget how to play already. I, I could try Transylvania, but it usually turns into Russian eventually. Mine usually turns into just, you know, a really weird version of the Count from Sesame Street. But that's what it's supposed to be. Yeah, you're right. That yeah. does turn into. I don't. I don't I <laughs> it just it does just turn into you know Russian like this is what you mean. And why don't we have enough? Like you know, the only Russian game I can think of is Metro, which is an excellent game for people who have not played it. The Metro Twenty whatever series. Hey, I'm right here. I'm gonna stand here. You better not shoot here. Oh, whatever. I can take like an ass load of punishment. Hey, buddy, I'm standing right here. You're stupid enough to shoot me when I'm standing right here. <laughs> Clearly not, but he he will he will get He Man to help. Oh, I I was trying to press B the whole time and like B's not doing anything. I guess like, you couldn't tell that I actually played this game yesterday. Less than twelve hours ago. Yeah, I know. Actually, more than it was, it was actually about twenty four hours by now. But it's still I don't know. It's still one of those. I, yes, my hunger. Nah, ah, ah, ah. He's just licking his ear like stop it. <laughs> Haha! <laughs> you dick. Gotta make sure there's no little vampire children running around, so you gotta snap their neck, too. No vampire children. Yeah, I don't want any copycats now. Which, I love how there there's vampires already in this universe, but there's only one Dracula. I don't know. Because in the, you know, first Lord of the Shadow, you fight the vampire queen, or whatever the hell she is. Maybe just a big With ass her vampire. army of vampires? Yes. And yet, I do think I would want to make all these guys my little vampire slaves, because that's exactly what I... Okay, thank you, game! I do know! I'm in the middle of a fight right now. I'm so happy this dude's just going to stand there and be like, oh yeah, let the game tell you what to do. The voice in his head. I know. Son of a... You know what I love? They didn't make me j like jam on B or something. Just B. Yeah, it's just like, just press the button, dude. You're good. Alright, jump. 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 Can he make it through the gauntlet in one try? So I'm doing much better than I did last time. And he just jinxed himself. You got nothing on me, Golden Knight of Goldenness. Jinx my ass. <laughs> I did that one try, motherfucker, because I'm not going to tell you how many tries it took me the first time I did it. Because <laughs> you lost count? Yeah, no, because I got so fucking frustrated with it. I hate jumping, like, time jumping shit. And I know this game has a lot of it, because the last game had a lot of it. Oh, ha! Ah, I didn't even mean for you to do that. Dumbass. I know. I just wish it was Homer Simpson in the Golden Armor, just so every time he does it, just... Don't! <laughs> yeah, every time he hits you... Woo! I know. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> ah! No, yes! Give me that neck! Oh! Oh, and then snap and, it. Of he, like, he's very wasteful. I can tell you right now, he could, probably could have got way more nourishment from that one dude. Oh, yeah, you know, go, um... Um... What's that Ethan Hawke movie? Uh, oh, Daybreakers. Daybreak. Yeah, you know, just harvest them. Make, Fuck make, yeah. Make a human farm. They won't mind. These guys are mindless drones, anyways. But instead, he's like, "I need one slurp of you." Ah, gross coconut. Snap. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. I I do love how like. Okay, come on, dude. Come on. We don't need more troops to come out here. Just do it. See? No, he wants more troops. Pussy. I know. He's just like, oh, how about we just fight ourselves? So, Nick, I, this is going to be a weird thing to bring up in this show, but, you know, I don't know. I'm probably going to forget about it by tomorrow. I think we need to bring up to anyone who's listening right now just something. And it has nothing to do with this game, but it has something to do with something that bugs the shit out of me. Okay, you know Subway and Big City, those places like that let you Quiznos, that let you build your sandwich. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> hey, he's not letting me play now. He's like, no, no, you gotta stand here and watch this. Uh, if you have like a large order and you see someone get up right before you start ordering, right behind you, maybe be polite. Ask them, hey, are you gonna be like, you know, do you have a lot of sandwiches? Like, do you only have one thing? If they say yes to that question, let them go ahead. 
Because there is uh, no reason um, for you to... Um, we live in America. People are assholes. I know. Everyone's a dickhole who needs to try to get in first. And I love how there's that... Oh, yeah. I was about to say. There's just a couple nights just standing there. Ew. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just... Ah! Damn it! One of those guys had AIDS! <laughs> I don't understand... Like... He has magic blood, and I think that's the only reason why this any of this makes sense on how he destroys this thing. <laughs> uh, have you ever seen Vampire Vomit? No. Yeah. I've never it's met a vampire. Explosive as a shit. <laughs> what, what is it, the alien blood? You know, like, <laughs> they just, you know, it just starts corroding the whole thing. And you know what he's thinking right now? He's like, God damn it, I should have destroyed this thing outside the castle. <laughs> and then I don't well, even know. You, know. you guys are already in the castle, I thought. Unless that robot's the only thing that made it, and like... I don't know. I know. Get up here! Oh, God! What the fuck? I know, you got that one dude trying climbing up the ladder. He's, oh, shit! Cl- trying to climb down as quickly as possible. You know, one guy in the background. My leg! I know. My leg! I wish they had that Wilhelm scream that time. I love that scream. I get so Twitter paid anytime I hear it in any movie. Oh, yeah. And then these guys are like, Jesus. Who's the asshole who had the one weakness? Oh, my God. Did somebody get the license plate of that hand? I know. Do we have to trade insurance? That thing wasn't even paid off yet. God damn it, Dracula. I don't have more of those jokes we can make about this. Oh. And here comes, I know, I love how now they're going to do like, oh, instead of all of us to tag Dracula at once, we're going to let Golden Asshole di- fight. Stay golden, pony boy. <laughs> I saw some funny ass thing on Facebook where it was making fun of that, where it's just like when you, your friend, when you find out your friend wasn't even paying attention to the thing you said and it just says like, stay golden, pony boy, <laughs> it was making the outsider's joke. God, you know, I really didn't like that book or that movie. See, I actually did. Oh, yeah, what, Golden Knight? Uh, can you think of a... Okay, there, there's got to be a joke here somewhere with this dude. Well, he is your knight in shining armor. <laughs> Thank you. I was like, we, na- we have to make a joke about this golden dude, because, you know, before he's about to go Darth Maul in our ass. <laughs> I know. <laughs> nah, oh. dude, that's totally Icarus. Icarus? Yeah, Kid Icarus from... Oh, actually, he does have the, that kind See? Of... See, it's yeah. totally Kid Icarus. With his magic bow! That's, that's made sword. of two swords. <laughs> that's cheating, dude. Uh, I do, I do, we will get to see that most badass scene, though, that I was so happy about. Shut up! Spoilers! There's, <laughs> spoilers! That's a minor spoiler that's like five minutes ahead! You bitch! I know, now people are just gonna skip five minutes ahead. What the hell was he talking about? Because we don't need to see him fight. It's not like I'm doing a strategy guide of how to beat this guy. I mean, okay, what you have to do is keep the sword equipped the entire time, because, like, who the hell cares? Thank you, game. What else you have to do... Oh, Jesus. Oh, X, 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 Okay. Well done. Yeah, Thank keep you. thrusting. Yeah, oh. just like that. Penetration. Now, dude, this is like a Star Wars fight. He has red lightsabers, I have a blue lightsaber. Oh, except for no one in Star Wars had wings or a coat. Dude... You know, I kind of, I just, you know what I want? Because J.J. Abrams is directing the new Star Wars. Just to have Khan be a Sith. He, his name is Khan and everything. I know, and then just like, you know, stop the Trek Star Wars fi- a war. Let's just stop the wars. From now on. Ah. I don't know. There's some people that just got mad about that. Me saying, even suggesting that. How dare you even suggest mixing those two? Yeah, I just broke your defense. That's what you get. Because there's no grab button here. Ugh. Stand still, you little shit. An intelligent player might learn to start dodging those wing explosions. Boy, they don't do any damage. <laughs> I mean, I, honestly, I would have to. I would be worried about it if I was actually getting hurt by him. <laughs> All right. Oh, aren't you fancy? An intelligent player just keeps dodging those when uh, when he choreographs his moves each time, like those wing explosions that don't do anything but just push you back. I feel like that's a very you know bad strategy. And plus, I also am using the sword that just keeps healing me the, the entire time. So every time I hit him, I get health back. So even if he does hit me, he just doesn't do anything. Oh, 
that's the purpose of that sword. Well, yeah, it's like well, it's like the last game where you had the the red stuff. Yeah, thank you, game. I am well aware of it. Just because I'm not doing it doesn't mean I don't know how to do it. Just like this is supposed to be his dark power attack. This is supposed to be his light, you know, magic. You know, it's very reminiscent of the previous, which it sh should be. But I like the fact they give me a sword instead of just the whip. Instead of just the whip that just mm -hmm. glows different colors. And if you want the whip, say you don't like either one of those, you could be like, oh, I'm Castlevania, bitch. I don't care if he's Dracula. He uses a whip now. A whip made of blood. That's not the most metal thing you've ever heard. I don't know what is. A whip made of blood? Uh, orphan's blood? No <laughs> doubt. Is he, like, weak enough for me to, like, press B against him? Because he doesn't have any health left. Nick, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Because he's being a bitch right Just now. keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Dude, I fucking hate that movie. Okay, here's the... Yeah! Hey, Baldy Locks! What happened to all your cool ass helmet? Oh shit! Oh god! Oh god! Not the not the cross! Anything but the cross! Oh no! I, I, I don't know why, but right there, I just had like a Spider-Man moment. Just oh no! You found my one weakness! No! Oh no! A cross! My wind weakness! Who's the one that spread this fucking rumor? Huh? 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 One-eyed? Come on, Cotton Eye Joe! I know. I want him just to like. Weak. Ah, damn it! Yeah, I have long fingernails for a reason. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh yeah, this, you know, honestly, it's it's a shame we're talking over this thing because it is awesome. Well, you know, I know, some people, oh, shut up then, well, fuck you, I don't want to shut up. I'm going to talk over the entire thing because I don't have subtitles on, the volume is going to be turned down low anyway, so you can't hear it. Oh yeah. Paraphrase. Uh, basically, what he's doing, he's just repeating the exact, you know, he's saying some Latin, by, this is the part where I was saying they kept talking Latin because I don't know what the hell they're saying. But yeah, he's like saying some type of Bible thing, he, and Dracula's saying it with him. And it's just like, you know, just, oh, it's so awesome. And then all these dudes are like, damn it, Jim, you should have stopped saying it! Stop saying it, Jim, he's not worried about it! And then I think eventually he starts saying, like, how your God's not going to protect you. He kind of, he, can you imagine Dracula's not really the best Christian? It's kind of weird. You know what this is, though, what people don't know? the next Assassin's Creed game. Those were a bunch of Templars we just fought, Nick. We're an assassin. Just going way <laughs> back in time. Way back in time, and we're adding... They weren't aliens, you stupids. They were just magical beings. <laughs> Everyone got it completely wrong. They're like, oh, it's all based off 2012. No. It's all based off Dracula being the first assassin. <laughs> well, actually, I think Dracula came after Etsy, or Altair. I really have no idea when this takes place. Well, you know, honestly, that looks like a metal weapon if it wasn't just melted and burnt. <laughs> like, that would be an awesome, like, just axe to use. Just a cross axe? Yeah, cross axe. And then for those of you who don't know who this is, that's Alucard, the most emo little bitch of a vampire there is. I don't, I'm not a fan of Alucard. He's kind of, you know, he's supposed to be the good vampire, you know, I'm I'm gonna out myself right now, but he's like the angel in this universe, you know. The wow. vampire. <laughs> yeah. I used to watch that show. I'm not gonna lie. Everybody used to watch that show. Uh, I know. I'm pulling some. Actually, Angel, I guess, was early 2000s. Buffy was n late 90s. Well, yeah, but yeah, you know, it's the Whedon verse. Yeah, so we. I I liked Buffy for for a couple of seasons. It got kind of stupid towards the end. I'm not gonna lie. And then Angel, I, I never really got completely into Angel. I did actually see the season finale, which I had a problem with that too, for people who never watched Angel as pretty sh shitty series finale. Alright, I'm gonna skip this because it's just really uninteresting to watch. And plus we only have two minutes left, so we're just gonna skip ahead to more cutscenes. Skip ahead to right now in your backyard. Yeah, I know, exactly. It's many centuries later. We don't really know when, so this is, could be like, the Bush era, the Clinton era, this could be the Reagan era. We don't know. I don't know. I just named President's era. Sure shit, not the Obama era, because we wouldn't have them. <laughs> Actually, I want to see that be an anti-Obama thing now. Dracula just risen from his grave. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> <laughs> All the goth kids. Dracula just risen from his grave. Thanks, Obama. I know. We Damn being, it, Obamacare. <laughs> we were being serious. I could never tell. God, Dracula was the first goth kid, and that's why he got himself a castle, and, and I just wanted you to see how old and pathetic he looks now. 
he's just like, what? What? like and, and as I told Nick, I'm gonna say it again because it's worth re- repeating. He looks like a he looks like a long haired Mr. Burns. <laughs> Especially when he stands up and he's all, like, skinny and just nasty. Now, uh, now, you played Mirror of Fate. Does it explain what happened in between? It's exactly. What, you know, what I skipped was what Mirror of Fate was. That's exactly what happens and, in Mirror of Fate. And where Alucard came from. And yeah, it show you get a play, you know, basically spoilers for Mirror of Fate. I'm gonna, I'm just going to be a little bit longer than usual just because I want to spoil Mirror of Fate. For Patrick you. Stewart. Yeah, because it's, it's about, it's almost a year old game. It was a DS game, whatever. But basically, you get to play as Trevor, uh, Trevor Belmont, who later becomes Alucard, and you can play as Alucard, and then you also play as Simon Bella, Belmont. And as the beginning of this game shows, they both team up to kill Dracula, and they do slay him. But as you can Certainly see... Certainly not very well. Well, at the end, Alucard just looks down, because Simon's like, Yeah! Yeah! Mm! And Alucard's just like, Dude, don't think we're done. And then, nope, nope, we're good, we're done, I know. let's go. And Simon's like, dude, I'm human, so he's gone, I don't care. You, you're the one that gets to deal with him later. But anyways, that is it, everybody, I hope you enjoyed part two, and I hope you enjoyed that spoiler of, you know, Mirror's, Mirror of Fate. But honestly, for those of you who really want to get into this universe, I can highly recommend playing Mirror of Fate before playing this game. Um, it's good old, it's good old style Castlevania, not very long, really a lot of fun. But anyways, that is it, everybody. Thank you. Visit boyscreenpod.com for all our other videos ad-free. Uh, don't forget to let us know what you think. Subscribe. Visit us on Facebook. We are the Blood Screen Podcast, and we are out!